and having a purpose are kind of similar but different. You know, computer is written like it has a purpose. It has a uh, programming, so it has to follow the road from A to B. Human beings, this power of choice, wow, great. That shows that you truly are alive, that you truly are a sentient individual. You know, your individual consciousness is just as important as all the other consciousness. You know, just like all the other stars and all the other uh, physical laws and rules. Could you imagine a universe if just one of those laws or rules went missing? Like, say, gravity. You, you think, oh, well, what, what does gravity matter? Have you ever been born in space? Have, have you seen what happens to things that are born with no up and down? Gravity is essential for the way we are. If we lived in space, we'd be like round blobs within two or three generations. There'd be no need to develop muscles. You know, you'd be like an amoeba. Would you, Do you fancy looking like an amoeba? Because I don't particularly like that. You know, we are what we are. And sometimes accepting, which is the opposite of bigotry, and the, and the opposite of prejudice. Acceptance is the key. It tells you this in the Bible. Another way of saying this, agreeing. People need to learn to agree with things. You know, there are so many things to agree on that the things that we disagree on are infinitely small. It's like we're, we're looking through a microscope and suddenly we see it. Wow, it's huge, that, isn't it? That problem, it's massive. Through a microscope. But step back a bit. Wow, it disappeared, didn't it? Because only what we choose to focus on at that time. Time's another thing that's funny, isn't it? Because from time and from moment to moment, you change. All these infinite changes going on. That's what's great about life. That's what makes life, life. You take time out of it. Everything stood still at, the, at that moment and forevermore, nothing will change. We don't live like that. So there's hope for you. Tomorrow can be different from today. And you choose what tomorrow's going to be, don't you? You choose what clothes you're going to wear, don't you? You know, people choose to have the jobs that they hate. And people choose to to feel the way they feel. <clears throat> when someone presents some information. You have the power to change your own thinking. If you let others have that power to change your thinking, then you're not really in control, are you? And that's why... The mind trick of government, where others are governing the minds of others and saying, you'll do this, or it's okay if we do this, isn't it? Well, there's a lot of people that are asleep and, and don't even hear the question, or don't even go, what? What did you say? Can you repeat that? Or, I don't understand what you're saying. Please explain a little bit more. So, you know, because everything's a sharing of ideas. You're hearing words, aren't you? Every word I say is an idea and an idea pops into your head and you go and, and that's how you're able to know what i'm saying but at the same time everything i'm saying is abstract i've not presented the physical object into the room you know like hieroglyphics and hieroglyphics is a strange language you know symbolism powerful you say a picture says a thousand words and believe me it does so we've got these powerful tools that are at our fingertips, everybody has a superpower then. Everybody can type uh, on Facebook. And, and, and depending on the words that they use, they construct an idea. And in that imaginary fictional world, it suddenly creates a power in the real world because people believe it. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah, so I just want everybody to, you know, start being a bit open-minded. On all sides, okay? Because we are together are going to find the answer. It's really, really simple. I, I keep telling you. And maybe it just sounds, a, you know, flaky or whatever. But that's how it is. We've got to love each other. And then you'll see the, the answers are really, really simple. And life will be nice for everybody. All right? And the people at the top, stop being scared. But you're going to have to recognize that the change is going to be everywhere. And you're part of it. So start changing your hearts, right? Because you, most of all, right, have lost touch. 
You shouldn't even be scared. You shouldn't even have to feel like you walk around with bodyguards. You should feel like everybody just cares and loves you. And they would if you did the right thing. If you were really genuinely caring. You know? Stop being scared of the myth. Because your myth is JFK. They said that so, oh, if you step out of line, if you do this, then the corporations are going to come after you. Listen, corporations, it's over for you too if you don't, you don't get in with the program. Human beings will just switch off and say, we're not buying your products anymore. So it doesn't matter who you've got in power. We'll find a way around all of that. We always have and we always will. You know? It's just when there's there's no crisis, there's no heroic emergency, the people will leave it to others to, to sort it out for them. But I'm telling you, yeah, we're all needed together. Yeah? Nothing's going to change overnight, but it is changing. And we have got bigger threats you know, like Fukushima and things that we should be sorting out together. Yeah? Not bickering and fighting and trying to belittle. Because you're trying to belittle us and we're trying to belittle you. Stop it. And be grown up. Be an adult. Right? It's time. It's time. Okay? Not tomorrow. Now. Telling yourself everything. You change tomorrow. Watch the movie. It's all about what we do now will affect the future. If you just want to take a simple, you know, spoiler. But watch the film, yeah? Look into yourself. Yeah. Start reading more. Start educating yourself. Look into what people say. Don't just go, no. Yeah? That's ignorance. And I'm sure you're not an ignorant person. I'm sure you could actually be very intellectual. And very funny. And very everything. Yeah? Very likeable. But you've got to start doing it. In a real human way. Stop being a robot. Yeah. Recognise that. We've got answers too. Okay. And we're going to find them together. Together. Right. With compassion and love. But it doesn't mean that sometimes we won't disagree. That's life. Men and women disagree. You know. All over. But it's how we handle it, isn't it? Life is more important. You know, and we get to that through caring about each other. You didn't grow up to be an adult if someone didn't care for you as a baby. And that's what it's all about. We're all babies. Once a man, twice a child. We're all babies. Stop thinking we're grown up. We're not. Everybody inside me is still the same as when he was 12 and 16 and 18. You carry that with you. It's just that you, you're supposed to be better than that now. You're supposed to be like, you know, ultimate. Spider-Man, Ultimate Superman. Come on. It's, it's your destiny to do great things. It's our destiny to do great things together, right? Common sense things and to listen, right? Otherwise, we will all destroy each other with our ignorance. And that's not what it's about. It's about love. So, be open-minded and be caring, right? Because that changes the future into what we all want it to be what the, you know i just feel great after watching that film they, they're finally understanding or i should say overstanding because for too long we've been under things they're finally overstanding we stand in love we don't fall in love we stand in love peace out